Okay, so here's a sheet pull installation install on the Sprinter van. So we're using this stuff on the walls, 3M seven, Super 77, legal in the state of California, unlike a lot of other stuff. That's, uh, anyway, sheet pull is wonderful, you can touch it, but uh, regular installation is not. But how do we stick it on the wall? And that's the other panel you can see right there that we already put on. So we're going to put on some of this stuff here first. Just get it to stick on the wall so it doesn't collapse. And again, this uh, sheeple is great. 10% more insulating factor than Pink Panther stuff. And it's natural. This stuff's probably not so good for you. But um, we just measured this. And then we got our section all, all ready here for us. And it has this uh, this fiber on the back to keep it in, intact. I don't know if you can see that right there. Uh, it's like a mesh, plastic, fishnet type stuff. Wait for that to set up. We're just going to plop that right on. Like that. Yeah. And uh, like that. And push that into place. And if you can see, there's a little bit of dust. But that stuff is that's uh, this white powder stuff. That's a type of borax, basically, if you know what borax is. And that keeps it's like a natural mold inhibitor, completely natural. And uh, <clears throat> that keeps any bugs. It's like an anti bug repellent. And uh, keeps mold or anything if it gets moisture. And if you follow any type of uh, philosophy or subtle energy stuff, you heard of the Vedas. The Vedas uh, say, which are ancient thousands of year old books written in Sanskrit, they say that you can, uh, the wool itself is is very highly antibacterial uh, rather antibacterial not antibacterial but uh, what do you call it um, purifying the subtle energy of the of the body they recommend uh, priests or people who do meditation to wear wool fabric and what I'm doing now is I have a sheet of this stuff on the ground let me see if I can readjust the angle a little bit here and uh, have a sheet of this stuff on the ground down, down there. I don't know if I'll be able to get that in the video. Let's give it a shot. Yeah, there we go. And uh, the subtle energy of wool is very, uh, is very purifying and it creates a good vibration externally or internally on a spiritual or subtle energy level and uh, wool also as opposed to pink panther stuff has a special ability to uh, see and you can just uh, to interrupt myself you can just peel that right off it's in basically two parts um, you know two sheets that have been stuck together and let's see what that is now that it's all fluffed out. That is, this has been sitting out for a few days outside of the box. This is a bat of insulation. It's four inches. Um, yeah, it's uh, directly, yeah, it's four inches. It's marketed, it's actually a little bit, almost four and a half inches. Almost, when it's puffy. Just, just over four inches. But yeah, this stuff is, uh, the priests wear it to keep their subtle energy pure. And uh, in India, and uh, if you follow any type of meditation or yoga practice, the yogis wear it like that. So it's really good for subtle energy. It balances the moisture levels in the, in the air. Uh, 
as well when it's uh, it, it it keeps I was reading up about it when it's really dry it can hold a tiny micro bit of moisture not enough to rust anything and also borax itself is um, is anti-rust if you google borax you'll find a lot of anti-rust things online and uh, hey we're filming here and uh, putting this up on the walls and like that and so now we're going to stick this down here in the bottom and it's really easy you can see you just bifurcate it like that and it, it separates very easily but yet it, it, it has enough it has enough stickiness or whatever to um, to keep itself together and as I do this you see on the ground here um, there's all this stuff that falls out of it as you handle it more and more so we're just going to sprinkle that back on that's the borax stuff we have a whole container of it we've kept there's all types of pieces of wire and all types of things in there so we're just going to put that stuff back on there that's fallen out we went to the store and got some more borax to spill in there it is right there dun, 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 dun. yay you can eat it it's good stuff and uh, now we're going to put it down here as well Measure the right size first. That's about 12 inches right there. And how tall do we got this at? We got that about two feet by by one foot. Okay, so let's get a two feet by one foot shoes this stuff on there. One foot. And these pieces are 24 inches, whatever. Yeah, about 24 inches, so that's perfect. Two feet by, by one foot right there. And we just rip that like, like that. Get that all ready. Can't do this with Pink Panther, huh? Short sleeves and put your hand on there, you'll be an ocean of itchiness. And put a little bit of this sticky stuff so it doesn't fall down probably don't really need need it so much because it's going to be sandwiched in here but um, but actually we're going to use this piece this piece is a little bit thicker and that one piece one fat we find that one side is thicker than the other like this piece is two inches and this piece is two and a half inches that top piece the top piece is about two inches yeah the bottom piece is, yeah, two and a half inches. So let's use this piece, actually. So here we go. Probably ought to use a gas mask for this horrible glue stuff as it off gases and like that. So you can just rip this. This is the piece with that stuff on it, with that um, netting on it. So we're going to... Drop some of our powder back on. This powder just seems to fall off the more you handle it, but it doesn't seem to fall off once it's in place. That was a concern of mine once I noticed that this powder keeps on falling off everywhere. Um, so just like that. Fingers are all cut up from shoving my fingers in the walls so many times. With the wiring, which we now have all done, that's what this is ready for connecting the dots and everything everywhere. And we had to do this on the roof, that was a real mess because this other piece, the piece that doesn't have this stuff stuck to it, you can see it just. It just accordions out like this. It's just like an accordion. 
it's just folded if you can see that I don't know if you can see that let's grab the camera here and uh, can we see that in camera land hey Chandra can you hold this yeah awesome right here So we want to get the side angle and see, see it all just accordions out like that. Yay, balance. And it's actually a very thin piece that's just been stuck together like that. That's how the top and the bottom are. Okay, cool. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Kick that little button over. I think it's down there for you guys.